In a weekend dominated by home sides with up to eight home wins from ten matches, only Atletico Madrid managed to snatch three points on the road. The Colchoneros finished the first half of the season on top after conquering Balaidos, where Augusto Fernández returned to Vigo. Simeone's men applied their magical formula once again. Solid defence and Griezmann doing the business up front. Match day 19 also stood out because of some outstanding individual goal-scoring displays. At the Camp Nou, Leo Messi proved why he would go on to win the Ballon d'Or with a brilliant hat-trick against Granada. And at the Bernabeu, Gareth Bale responded with another hat-trick that added to Benzema's brace helped steer Real Madrid to a hefty win against Deportivo in a game that left us with the image of the weekend, Zinedine Zidane's debut in the Madrid dugout. Three other strikers also managed a two-goal haul at the weekend. Villarreal consolidated their Champions League place thanks to strikes from one of the revelations of the season, Cedric Bacambu. At the Pith Juan, Sevilla picked up three key points against Athletic with a leading role from Kevin Gameiro. And in San Sebastián, Jonathan de Jesus made the most of Aguirreche's absence with a brace. Now, another great ball in, Jonathan! Two from Jonathan! The Brazilian sentenced Valencia to another defeat as Gary Neville continues to look for his first Liga win after five games in the dugout. Opportunity on look at this crowd of Betis bodies. Well, they cannot keep the ball out. And talking of managers, this is another image which tells a story of its own. Pepe Mel suffering in the stands of the Coliseum. Well, Real Betis, and the shot is looped over off a deflection. Betis continued their poor run with another defeat against Getafe. A result that prompted the decision to sack the manager, who had taken the Andalusians back to the top flight less than a year ago.